Hello community, if you go to Hugging Face, we have there also AMD. AMD is a company and they publish here some beautiful models. And you told me I should have a look here at this space where we run here on AMD MI300X. And we have here the open system, the open weight model here by OpenAI GPT 120 billion. And you said, hey, have a look at this. So let's have a look at this. Just want to tell you one second. I think some of my viewers mixed up something because a 300X is something completely different. Have a look. If you go to AMD here, the Instinct GPUs that we have here, not the 350, wait a second. No, not those. Where are the 300? 300 here. Here we have the Instinct 300 MI 300. So here the X, this is it. So this is, a, in my understanding, a pure server. Look at the data sheet. This is what we are talking about. Yeah? I mean, we are talking about 128, no, one, 192 gigabyte here of memory for a GPU accelerator. So this is beautiful. But just to be sure that we talk here about the same thing, the GPU specifications. Beautiful. Here you have all the data, GPU memory, 192 gigabytes. Yes. So if we are talking about a 300X, I would suppose this is what we are talking about. And I know that some of you thought about, hey, wait, we talk about this. No, a framework, let's go, any system that is nice, modular and repairable. And you also have the, the 300 series, no? the 385 with 32 gigabytes VRAM, 395 plus 64 or 128 gigabyte. No? You can run it on Windows 11 or you have your Linux distro. In Windows, you have from the 128 about 96 gigabyte that you can use here for dedicated VRAM. Framework, and I'm thinking about this for myself, has here a cluster solution that is really, really interesting because, you know, it's modular. You can start with one and then you have multiples. So nice. You see here your, and I'm just looking here at different boards. You start here also, yeah. You see, the Max 300 series, but this is something different to what we will be talking in a second. You have here the 300 series with the 3 at 5, below 1000 euros, 64 and 128 gigabyte here. Then we are close to 2000 euros for one. So nice idea that we can use this then here for a server architecture, but just that you understand there is a difference and I don't think here. Yeah, you can build it yourself. It is more or beautiful. I really like the idea. If you already have some experience with framework here, with those specific main boards, hey, why not leave here a short comment, say yes, recommend it. No, cannot recommend it. I would love to have some feedback from the AI community regarding this. But what we are interested in is now here, uh, GPT OS 120B from AMD M300X. So this is here the server platform. I'm so sorry to tell you this. I think there was a little mix up. So let's have a look how good it is. We are not running on NVIDIA. Can you imagine this? We are running now on AMD. Let's check it out. Let's do this. Additional inputs. Okay. Now a system prompt is just your helpful assistant. This is great. Temperature is default here by AMD set. I will not touch the default temperature. I will just here for a helpful assistant and just give you a very short remark. I just add a little bit of say, hey, you're an expert in solving complex logic puzzles and you excel at causal reasoning. You go step by step, explore each possibility, each permutation, give it your full power and sync with your maximum capacity until you reach a solution. So you see, couldn't be easier. Just input here my test and let's say go. So here we are in real time. This is here the test that you have seen I have done with other LLMs. This is not my latest test. And I have here the reference benchmark here so that you can see how other models are doing with this particular test. So as you see, our task is known. We have to go in an elevator from the floor zero to the floor 50. I have defined some specific functions on a limited set of button of button presses here on the elevator. And we just have a limited amount of energy. We have some code cards that we need to open up here, higher floors. And the task is simple. Find here the shortest path, the minimum set of button presses to reach with 
enough energy from floor zero to floor 50. Do not overshoot, respect all the instruction I give you and it's a little bit complex, it needs a little bit of causal reasoning but otherwise let's see what is the result. So focus is here on the hardware but of course we implement here a model, the, the open weight model by OpenAI. So let's see what is here at first run the best solution it can find. Now we have to look at the tokens. As you see, we are deep into the reasoning process. We have 18 presses. Okay. The flags, summary, the total button presses. Remember, this is here from OpenAI, the open weight model. This is not anything connected with GPT-5. This is it. So we have here a result. The elevator run above reaches the floor 15, 18 button presses. It finishes with enough energy with the tokens. It holds three secret code cards, never triggers a random trap and obeys every rule. Beautiful. Now 18 button pushes here is not at all anywhere near what the best model can achieve. Show me that you indeed found a valid solution respecting here all my instruction. And I have to tell you for an AMD, not bad, not bad at all. Remember, this is the 300X, the Instinct series, don't mix up with the, if you want, laptop series here, the 300 uh, Ryzen series here for, also specialized here for AI implementation. This is the solution, a complete step-by-step -step run, Pareto Optimal. This is not correct, but never mind. For an open weight model by OpenAI, this is the kind of complexity that it can solve. However, the speed was impressive here for an AMD implementation, real nice. Son of my user said, hey, what happens if you reduce the temperature to absolute zero? I don't know, let's do this. Is there a retry? Yes, there's the retry button. So let's have a look. <laughs> I don't know if it makes sense, but hey, we just can test it out. This is the reason why Hugging Face generated here spaces and AMD want to show us here how great their MI300X solution is. Speed is absolutely impressive here. Great. Unfortunately, I have no further details on the technical implementation, but if this is here, the performance that we can get from AMD, absolutely happy with this solution. So three distinct codes, yes, final answer. The 18 press sequence is full valid, yes. Do we have here the explanation? Yes. All special floor rules respected, okay. And then we have here, yes, we have here our 18 steps explained in detail here on the right hand side, what happened, why this is happening. And you can see it failed quite miserably in the complexity performance because, you know, one of the best solutions is not 18 steps, but eight steps. But never mind, this is here an open AI model, the OSS 120 billion. But for the implementation here on the hardware side, I think absolutely fascinating. So for me, AMD hardware solution absolutely work. Great stuff. Velocity is absolutely that I can work with this on the cloud, over the cloud. And yes, of course, me too. I would be interested here to have here local AMD hardware. If you have an experience with Rock or RockM, please leave a short comment here on this video. Otherwise, I see you in the next one.